Switching to e-cigarettes reduces the amount of cancer-causing tobacco toxins by 97% in just 6 months. Vaping is 97% safer than smoking, say health experts. E-cigarettes, 97% safer than smoking according to new study. Cancer Research UK study into vaping effects show 97% safer than cigarettes. Why a landmark study suggests e-cigarettes are 97% safer than smoking. Oh my god! Is it now a numbers game? Till yesterday, we were preaching vaping to be 95% safer than smoking. Based on scientific studies it was, which was confirmed by Public Health England. And now we up it by 2% further. Are we just playing with numbers? Heck no, this is a fact check my friends. Hey folks, Corax here. And the unscientific cohorts of Big Tobacco and Big Pharma, please don't hurt us. Not anymore. This new study, funded by Cancer Research UK, was undertaken by University College London and the report was published on February 7, 2017. The study was conducted by a group of experienced British and American researchers led by Dr. Lyon Shahab of UCL and co-authored by a few others, especially to note some popular ones like Professor Anne McNeil, Deputy Director of UK's Centre for Tobacco and Alcohol Studies, who also co-authored the previous Public Health England's e-cigarette review, which confirmed vaping was 95% safer. Secession expert Professor Robert West, Director of Tobacco Studies at the Cancer Research UK, Dr. Macy Novich of Roswell Park Cancer Institute, New York, who published a similar study last year. The study researched broadly four categories of human samples. One, cigarette users who have never used any alternative methods. Two, cigarette users who are using alternative methods, NRTs like nicotine gums and nicotine patches to quit smoking. Three, cigarette smokers who are also off and on vaping. 4. Former smokers who have completely switched to vaping. The researchers tracked 181 people for 6 months and they found that former smokers who had completely switched to vaping in 6 months had severely reduced their levels of carcinogens. And now they had 98% less metals in their system 98% less carbonyls, 97.5% less nitrosamines, 97.1% less volatile organic compounds like acrylonitriles and aldehydes, and 89% less polyaromatics. All of the above are known cancer causing substances found in regular tobacco cigarettes. Nicotine gum and patches users also had their levels lower but the levels were not quite as low as regular vapors. Incidentally, the study also found that people who continued to smoke as well as vape only saw toxic chemicals drop by just 20%, which suggests a complete switch is needed to reduce the exposure to these harmful substances. Dr. Hillary joins us now. Um, so they are safer. It all sounds very positive, uh, Hilary, mm. but you're a doctor yourself. For those people who are already smoking, and there are 10 million smokers in the UK, mm. this is really good news. It's even better news than we had from simulated experiments in the past that suggested that e-cigarettes were much safer than smoking tobacco. This confirms it. Remember, folks, it is not merely the propaganda by Big Tobacco and Big Pharma which is responsible for the lackluster and more often the negative impact people have towards vaping. Part of the reason is that campaigners who in the past fought against tobacco industry were now also unwittingly campaigning against vaping firms, more often as a moral crusade than with any scientific basis. As Alison Cox, Cancer Research Institute's director said, this study adds to the growing evidence that e-cigarettes are much safer alternative to tobacco and suggests the long-term effects of these products will be 
minimal. Take note, this study was conducted on real smokers and real vapors on real time basis on a legit sample size. Both the size and the duration are established norm in the scientific community for long term studies as well as peer research. As such, my friends, chillax. The naysayers can't hurt us anymore. Remember, vaping is a healthier alternative. And we have the right to make that choice. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more.